blaming Greg Tardiff. <laughs> good morning, ladies and gentlemen. New today. How y'all doing today? Hopefully, you're doing pretty good because I'm doing pretty good too. So, I was actually watching one of Greg Tardiff's uh, reels and he was doing like on uh, IG and that song came on freaking uh, REM, Shiny Happy People. I'm like, not a day. Now it's been in my head for like a week. Cool, couple days, week, whatever. Yeah, I remember that too where uh, they were on Sesame Street too. Furry little monsters. And also, Michael Stipe, if you guys are old school cartoons, some of you young guys won't know. Space Ghost. Space Ghost and Michael Stipe were talking with each other. And Michael Stipe, or Space Ghost, like, shiny, shiny, shiny. Michael Stipe's like, Space Ghost, I hate that song. Oh, sorry. <laughs> Anyways, yeah. Like I said, morning, ladies and gentlemen. New shave today. How you doing today? Hopefully, you're doing pretty good because I'm doing pretty good too. Can't speak. All right, let's get right into this. Razor we're going with. Yeah, did a shave on Wednesday. So, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, Saturday morning right now, 11 a.m. Yeah. Razor we're going with, not, but I haven't wanted to use one for a while, and yeah, haven't used it in a while. So we're going with my Henson AL13++, medium aggression. There's no more aggressive one out there I actually would like to try, but yeah, this is just the plus plus one. Plus plus, yeah, plus plus. So, blade we're going with, going with these. I actually ran out of these a couple weeks ago, not even open yet, and I really like these blades, these Lord Cools. So I bought a hundred of them, so it's like eight bucks for a hundred. Mild blade, so let's see how it goes today. So, yeah, bought a hundred of them because I like them. Damn it, Greg Tardiff. <laughs> Shaving with Greg Tardiff. All right, these are made in Egypt, so let's see how they go on the Henson today. I've been wanting to use this razor for a while, but haven't. There, get the cat hair off there. Put the washer on there. Probably don't need it, but I do. I put a washer on there. Get some more of the cat hair off there. Dang it, Rocco. All right, so yes, AL13. This is the medium aggression one. No overhang. There we are, loaded up and ready to go. All right, brush we're going with today. Go with the whole blue type thing today. Just bright, shiny blue. Mojo Handcrafts. This one I call my Elsa. 26 millimeter cashmere nut not just like Elsa's hair <laughs> wanted to get I wanted to get this like white but I couldn't find a 26 millimeter that was like pure white <laughs> kind of like uh, my Paul H films one now this one's just bright white that's what I wanted for it I thought it would have looked really cool but I couldn't find a 26 millimeter one that was that bright white so we just went with the cashmere blonde hair it looks cool right yeah you guys see me use this one awesome awesome brush I thought it fit today so Soap we're going with today. We are going with... This is my very first Shannon Soaps, too. This is from ShannonSoaps.com. F-Mail. What? That's mean. Why do you say F-Mail, dude? <laughs> it's a joke. Anyways, this is a collaboration between Shannon Soaps and BBS.Live, Melly Mel, and... Nate Dog. You guys know who they are. Very cool looking. It's got that on the back. It says F-Mail 522. And it's on the splash, too. It says F-Mail 522. That's what the silver sharpie though so yeah anyway so this is only this is exclusive only exclusive to the razor company so that's the only place you can get this at this is cool it says f mail but it's got these rivets they're not real rivets it's not like it's really riveted in the plastic it's like a sticker or something but that's a freaking cool to be shaved <laughs> that's a really cool touch i've never seen before so i like that that looks neat very, very cool. This is the Chupacabra Base Shaving Soap F Mel. So let's see. Um, the Razor Company will be donating a portion of the proceeds from F to F Mel to Mel's favorite charity, St. Jude Children's Research Hospital. So when you buy it, proceeds go to that as well, which is really cool. The scent is inspired by F Black by Salvatore Ferragamo. Ferragam I've never smelt Salvatore Ferragamo before, but yes, this is what we're going with. Uh, with sensual tonka, tonka bean and latinum on the bottom, light and bright lavender and apple on top, and hints of spicy black pepper and coriander in the middle. f Mel is a vibrant, exciting, and spicy, just like everyone's favorite Cisco drinking, table breaking, if you know, you know, wet shaving legend, Mel Cayenne. And comment below if you're from planet Earth. Comment below. You guys know who Mel is. 
Notes, top note is bergamot, middle note is lavender, base notes are sandalwood, cedar, vetiver, and ambergris. Now this to me, I get the apple right off the top. Very nice cologne type, sophisticated type scent. The only, I've used the splash on my hand before, on the back of my hand to smell it. The way I could describe this, if you, I don't like describe, like say, oh, this smells like this, this smells like this, but to me, this is in the same realm of if you have smelled <clears throat> PAA Gondolier. It's in that kind of cologne fresh, spicy, masculine type scent. It reminds me a lot of uh, PAA Gondolier. I'm not saying it smells exactly like it, but that gives you guys a hint if you smelled Gondolier before and you like Gondolier, I believe you would like this as well. So, yes, let's get this scraped up. Load it in the brush. Load it in the brush. Yeah, we're going to load it in the brush. Load it in the bowl. And be right back. Oh, all right, back. Yeah, my face. Yeah, only a couple days worth of growth. Uh, I've been wanting to try that hand for a while though. I haven't used it in a minute. Um, yeah. All right, appreciate. It. We're going with PA Ice Cube 2.0 Blue Mentholated. Mentholated, yeah, because it feels good in Arizona, because it's 900 degrees outside. Well, not today. Today's only supposed to be 106, and that's not bad. We can deal with that. When I get to 116, 118, yeah, that ain't no fun. Drop the cube! Oh! Saturday. How y'all doing today? This guy's got plans, family, doing stuff. I'm staying in. <clears throat> well, I'll go shopping later. Get some, like, weed killer and bug killer. Yeah. Alright, so there we go. This one took me a little bit to lather. It's almost like an opaque, like, clear. Not clear, but it's... Yeah, it smells good. It's almost like opaque, though. Like... I don't know if this is a cream or this is a crope. It's yeah, but we're gonna shave with it and it's I think I turned it turn. I think I did pretty good with the lather, so we'll see how it goes. Anyways, yeah. Oh and you don't need much. Yeah, I get the apple right off the bat. Like it's apple-y. It smells good though. Ooh. Do 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 ba ba da bong. Nice lather though. All right, here we go. Pass number one, Henson, AL13, medium aggression. First use, Lord Cool. Super stainless Allen fingers. Don't really need it, but all right. Here we go, pass one. Two, three days of growth. Wednesday, today, Saturday. But yeah. Very, very easy, very easy razor to find that angle, and it's gone. I said, I've been wanting to use this one for a while, but I didn't want to do like seven days worth of growth. I mean, it probably could cut through it, but I want to do two or three days worth of growth. I know it could cut through it really well. 
Like this could easily be like a daily shaver for somebody. If you had to. Was that Salvatore Ferragamo? I've never smelt that before. Like I said, the only thing I personally could compare it to, just to give you guys a hint, or like, your mileage may vary, but to me, yeah, it's in that PA gondolier cologne type scent to me. But that's just me. Dono Argato, Mr. Ferragamo. So I'm starting to feel normal again now, without caffeine and alcohol. So, yeah, a little, a little rough for a little bit, but I'm doing better now. Boston, don't look back. Onward and upward. In a little rope up the chain, you said you had to get your laundry done. What does that mean? She said, ain't nothing gonna break in my stride. Nobody gonna slow me down. Oh no, I've got to keep on moving. Ain't nothing gonna break my stride. I'm running and I won't touch ground. Oh no. Matthew Wilder. Never gonna meet another girl like you. Won me over. Awesome. Very good. Yeah, this is a nice base, too. One weep right there. That ain't bad. All right. Cool. Another pass. Not that for Nice. All right, cool. Get you pass on the cheek. Oh, got me there. That's an Adam's apple. Oh, well, Adam's apple. <laughs> Top note apple. Yeah. Do, do, do. Da, da, da. Oh. That'll clean up anyway, though. It'll be fine. It'll be fine. Got two water cheeks in the neck. Couple there, right on the Adam's apple. That ain't bad though. I know that'll clean up really easy. Really easy clean up. All 
right, cool. I think we're done. I believe we're done. Ooh, this bathroom. Very close, efficient. Mm, just one of the, that, that one cleaned up. Just that one of the Adam's apple, huh? Oh, well, clean up our backpack. Cam back, yeah. Very close, very efficient, very smooth, sticky smooth. Yeah. Oh, very, very good. Couple on the Adam's apple, that one cleaned up, but yeah. Probably should have moved, the, moved my neck a little bit. Or, but yeah, it cut my Adam's apple. I'm good, though. Alan Block, I think I'm going to need the... Uh... Yeah, that's recording. <laughs> I don't think I'm gonna need styptic stick. We'll see. Most likely a melon. Most likely don't. Oh. Saturday in the park. I think it was the fourth of July. Doo -doo. Little little sting, not bad. Little sting. That a little bit better. Uh, uh, uh. Okay. Pat dry. I leave the alum on. You guys know that. Ugh. Some people wash it off. Doesn't matter. Do what you want. All right. So we're going with matching aftershave. Shannon Soap Company, made in Ohio. BBS Live F Mel Soothing Post Shave Splash. Now this doesn't have any alcohol in it either. So. Got shannonsoaps.com right there if you want to go check out their website. But this is exclusively only to the Razor Company. And it's the only place you can get it. <laughs> only place in town you can get it. Oh. So the ingredients are alcohol-free alcohol witch hazel, water, optional menthol. I don't know what that means. Fragrance and glycerin. If you guys want to look at that, that's it. So there's no... Yeah, see that cleaned up. There's no uh, alcohol in it. Other well, alcohol-free witch hazel. Use a lot because I like using a lot. Uh, nice. I'll use more. I can use more. I get the witch hazel. I get the witch hazel scent. Nice, 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 nice. Like, like I said, if it's a little close to uh, PAA Gondolier, not exactly, but that's the only way I could describe, like, what I think if I compare it to something. So, all right, cool. All right, recap of what we used today on the channel. Yeah, clean it. Good. Hey. Unbreakable Panetta Bowl Wood, my new favorite bowl. This is one I've been using a lot lately. You guys see it? PA Ice Cube 2.0 Mentholated. I like menthol, especially here in Arizona. Yeah. Pick, intergalactic base pick for scooping. Uh, Shannon Soaps F Mill Post Shave Splash. Non alcoholic. PA Allen Block. Also use the Henson AL13 Medium. With a Lord Cool DE Blade first use. Very good, very nice. We use my Mojo Handcrafts Elsa brush, 20, Elsa handle brush, 26 millimeter cashmere knot. If I could find a white one like that, I will, I'll pop it in there. But yeah, just for now, <clears throat> just leaving it like that for now. Yeah, my Mojo brush. And guys, didn't know. Didn't say this, but this is what I've been drinking today. This is my shaverage for today. Got this at Fry's. It's called Coco 5. And this is made in Phoenix, too. So, distributed by Coco 5, Phoenix, Arizona. I don't know if you guys will have this at, you know, East Coasters at, like, Kroger or stuff like that. But here, Arizona, yeah, well, I know Kroger owns Fry's Foods, but whatever. This is where I picked this up at. There's this one, there's a coconut one, and there's a cherry one. This is pretty good, though. That's our shavers for today. Hopefully IMCDB is doing good. And yeah. Cool. So that's the shave of the day. If you want to check anything out, <clears throat> put stuff down below. I think it's lim I think the FML is limited. I don't think it's gonna be it's like a permanent thing. Uh, here's the ingredients. 
you guys want to read these? There's all the ingredients in it. I think this is limited to, uh, not sure how long though it's going to be around. But yeah, very nice. Very, like I said, it reminds me a little bit, a little bit like PA Gondolier, that cologne If you're like that cologne fresh, like, cologne type scent like nice nice cologne type scent so that's what that reminds me of f mail shannon soaps f mail <laughs> okay that's it that's the shave of the day ladies and gentlemen so more to come yeah i got more stuff to do and yeah so hopefully ladies and gents have a good day good week good shaves good weekend more to come we're at 702. I'm gonna do a um, I'm gonna do a 700 subscriber giveaway. It's at 70. It was at 704 for a week, then 703, 704, 702. We're just gonna do a giveaway. So that's so what I'm gonna be posted next. So see you, ladies and gents, soon. Bye.